Tuesday night, the Central A&M Raiders hosted the Painted Panthers in a Christian County rivalry game early to start the basketball season. Both teams came out firing, starting with this three from Colby Old. Uh, we knew Central A&M was going to be aggressive, so we came out here looking to, we knew it was going to be a fist fight right off the bat, and we just came out here and we let them get in a little too close, rather than what we wanted, but uh, to come out with a win is always nice, especially in the first game. The win didn't come easy for the Panthers as the Raiders continued to battle until the very end as both teams traded buckets throughout the night. They just rebounded. They rebounded well. I mean, in the first half they were dominating us on the boards. In the second half we decided to come out and really play on the boards with them, which uh, kind of uh, yeah, kind of messed us up trying to come in in the second half when you know they got up big with them, boards and points. So. Yeah, we did play really well. I, I was worried that they had three games under their belt. They're physical. I thought our guys held their own pretty good in there for us not being as, as physical as they are. The Panthers took a 33-26 to halftime lead on the back of McMillan. Uh, Coach Smith wasn't very happy at halftime, so we kind of came out and uh, tried sticking it to him and getting back in the game and uh, just trying to close the gap and get that win. Chapin had 16 points for the Raiders to go with 7 rebounds. But Payne as McMillan led the Panthers to the win with 15 points and 12 rebounds to go along with some clutch threes from Blake Kircher. Definitely, they just took it to the whole strong. Is what they did. They took it so hard. That's, that was really hard, really tough to match up. The Raiders made it a one possession game late thanks to some strong play from their bench. But the Panthers regrouped and came up with a defensive stop at the end after all their starters scored at least eight points to finish off the game. I thought the most impressive, I think, because everybody's unselfish. Yeah. You know, I kind of thought coming into the season, we don't have that Gibson, that go-to score. One night it's going to be Wade, one night it's going to be Rhett, one night it's going to be Blake, and, and, you know, and there's going to be a lot of nights like this where everybody just chips in, and, and you know, we could have four or five guys in double digits, I think, potentially on certain nights. Payne held on for the 67-62 win over A&M. Uh, come out and play harder at the beginning, get the win early, you know. Don't let them get a big lead on you. you got to rebound better and we got to make more free throws. I'm kind of confident for the next game on Saturday. Just, it's always nice to start off with a win, get some confidence on all three levels for one, so happy with that.